The overall goal of this experiment is to measure temperature-dependent luminescent spectral intensities. This method can help answer key questions on the topic of excited state energy migration in metal complexes, such as ruthenium diamine complexes. The main advantage of this technique is that by using a simple apparatus and procedure, accurate temperature-dependent spectral intensities can be measured. Demonstrating the procedure will be Cameron Portoon, a technician from my laboratory. First, prepare about 3 milliliters of low molarity luminescent chromophore solution in water or in alcohol for the best combination of surface tension and solubility. Next, prepare a sample loop. Twist a length of bare copper wire around a nail or screw to give a single loop, followed by about 30 millimeters of twisted wire. Then rinse the loop with nitric acid, followed by distilled water, and finally with 95% ethanol. Be sure to put on protective gear for the next step. Dip the loop, once dry, into the sample solution. The surface tension of the solution should create a thin film of the solution in the loop. Then, immediately dip the loaded sample loop into liquid nitrogen to freeze and stabilize the thin film sample solution. Begin with preparing a copper constant tan or type T thermocouple from two lengths of copper wire and one length constant tan wire, which is a copper nickel alloy. Next.